if you've seen my previous video, you know I got these uh, six extra chucks with uh, the fissure lathe I picked up the other day. None of these actually fit the lathe, so they're pretty useless to me. I'm going to try and sell them, but I might have ending throwing a few away. Lots of jars are missing and uh, some of them are not in a great shape. This one here caught my attention. At first glance it looks like a uh, fat independent four jar. But uh, then you notice the, um, the adjustment screws or the extra adjustment screw on the side. It turns out this is an uh, independently adjustable four jaw scroll chuck. And I've searched the internet. They are more commonly known as uh, combination chucks. It's heavy. And uh, that's how far the uh, jaws will go. And the rest of the way needs to be done with the uh, individual adjustment screws. It says here that this uh, chuck was made uh, by the Union Manufacturing Company in New Britain, Connecticut. And that's in uh, the USA. I looked, uh, I looked on the internet and the company was in business from 1880 to 1990. So this uh, chuck could be pretty old. Although it is possible that uh, another manufacturer took over the factory and uh, made Union chucks long after the original company went out of business. The chuck looks uh, to be in decent shape, although the jaws are a bit loose. There's a bit of side play. They are also uh, pretty easy to adjust. Maybe a bit too easy. But uh, what do I know? It's my first uh, combination chuck. I'm not sure how useful a chuck like this would be. But um, I guess it would be good for uh, grabbing uh, square stock and uh, out of round objects. I will keep this one and maybe I'll even get to use it someday. Okay, that's pretty much it. Just a small video of something I find interesting. Maybe you too. And if not, uh, well, you better go watch uh, America's Next Top Model or uh, some real. Maybe you're into cooking. One of those cooking shows. Me, uh, I prefer the eating part. One more thing. This chuck here looks a lot like the chuck I refurbished a few uh, videos ago. It also has the uh, extra adjustment screws. Let's see what's inside. The screws on the rear seems to be missing. So I assume it will come apart when I loosen up these uh, three screws. They're actually pretty loose. Yeah, it is loose. Yep. That's exactly the same design. a bit of a richer
Well, too bad I can't find any uh, brand name or uh, patent numbers. It's a, it's a shame that this uh, shock doesn't have any jaws. Now it will probably end up in the scrap bin. <laughs> 